Voice123 is a great place to find voiceover work and they've recently had a bit of a makeover and what they've done is they've added these new things in called playlists which is confusing a few people including myself. So I'm going to show you how to use them and how to add them to your Voice123 profile. Let's take a look. Make sure that you're logged in to your Voice123 page. That's very important. And then what you want to do is go to your profile, which is down here in the bar on the left. And then you want to, that gives you this page, and you want to be able to go down to this bit here, which is playlist. This is the new bit. And this is where if you go to add, you will be able to add a new playlist and you can put the playlist name here and then add the samples from there. So this will basically create a container for you. So let's call this one corporates. Corporates, there we go. And now I want to add a sample to this and you can add quite a few of these uh, samples. And what you can do is record something specifically for it. And then you would, if you were recording there, you'd record on your mic and then simply upload it to this bit here. But what I'm going to do is go for option two. And that means adding in a pre-existing recording that I have in my collection. So let's go here. What I fancy is doing, uh, I quite like that one, which I did for a computer company and that's a real corporate -y thing. It gives you there the language, which in my case is English British. I'm a male adult. Others on camera infomercials could call it that or I could call it something else. I could call it training business presentations. And then I want to save the sample. And there we go. So that's within the playlist. It seems to have lost the playlist name. I've noticed this actually with this new Voice123 system. It seems to lose things. So you save them and then it, it loses them. So Voice123, I think you need to get your act together. Uh, let's just play this actually. On one hand, service providers. There we go. And now I want to save the playlist. So that's the whole thing. I can add more to it, of course. Playlist updated. And then if we go to view all, it's very slow. And I think Voice123 really need to up their game on this. Here we go. So I've got one sample there, look, corporate. And I can add some more. Uh, so I just edit playlist. Here's my corporate again. There's my first one. And then if I want to add another sample, I just go to my option two, existing samples, and then it gives me a list of what I need to do. Technical read, that looks like a good one to put in there. And then I save sample. And there it is. And then see that there. Technical read. And then I just save the playlist. Playlist updated look, and then there's the corporate now with two samples. And there they are. In theory, it's a terrific system because what it does is it makes it easier for clients to find their particular genre. And it's supposed to help with search engine optimization and so on, and, and will really increase the chances of hopefully you getting the work. But I think at the moment there are one or two bugs in that system, which I'm sure Voice123 will iron out, but it's a bit slow and a little bit clunky, but potentially it could be in its own way, a game changer. All right, thanks very much for watching today. Look after your voice and see you next time.